Hi old folks, this is Max from HighOnAndroid.com. Today we got unboxing of AT&T Galaxy S3! Hi old folks, this is Max from HighOnAndroid.com. We get high on Android every day. Um, so here's my fourth Galaxy S3 I've got. Um, here we go. And uh, let's open it, unbox the AT&T version. I finally got it. Um, it was on in stock, it was out of stock, it was in stock, it was out of stock. It, it went on for like a whole week. But I finally got it and uh, I won't have to go crazy. Um, there we go. And I uh, got a bunch of stuff. It's a throwaway. Um, even the box. Throw it away. I was just throw away everything today. That's how you unbox it. Yoo-hoo! Throw away. Whoop! Not that one. Um, inside you will find a bunch of stuff. Here we go. We don't need all of this. Um, let's keep all of this. And my dog's going crazy. She thinks I'm crazy. She thinks I'm crazy. Um, so it actually comes with a blue box because it's the blue version. Um, let's unbox it. High on Android style. Ah. Throw all of it away. Um, this is actually my first um, completely blue version here, um, and I've got the battery here. And uh, yeah, my dog thinks I'm gone insane, which happens when I unbox stuff. Um, it's okay. Uh, so it comes with a bunch of earbuds. I oh, oh, this one actually comes with uh, buttons here. Sort of like the old school style, the AT&T version actually is a slightly different. The other versions don't have that button. Um, and also a cable here, micro USB cable. And actually this one is actually seems longer than all the other ones. But we don't need that either. I will feed it to the dogs. And uh, I have too many of those. So we will end up uh, with the uh, phone here. Let me just uh, swap the SIM card in real quick. This is the i747 series. Um, let me just grab my, my uh, card from my i9300. Um, so there we go. And power. And pretty much nearly identical to all the other ones here. And let me power it on for you. And let me swap the uh, lens real quick so you can you can see better. Um, I'll be right back. There we go. Actually, let's check it out. Um, this is the one I replaced. Um, you can see it's pretty much exactly the same, but, but the back on this one is actually white. Um, so it looks good. Uh, but it seems like the battery doesn't power on. I think it's actually out of batteries. Um, so I'm going to replace it real quick with a uh, full battery that I have. One of the coolest thing about the Galaxy S3, everything, every part is pretty much interchangeable. Um, but I actually, you know what? I like the metal uh, kind of a look on the blue, the blue, is this a blue pearl one? Yeah, I think so. But there we go, I've got it powered up. Um, pretty much nearly identical to, to the T-Mobile version and to the i9300 and I'm collecting all of them. I've just got to get the Sprint one and I've, I've got all the collection, you know. It's like a new hobby um, for people who like smartphones. And uh, I, I know there's more people doing this. Um, specific time. Not now, next. i just put M. There we go. And let's see if it picks up 4G. Um, there you go. And this one actually 4G LTE enabled. I, I have to actually put my 4G LTE enabled um, card, which is actually which is actually on my T-Mobile. Hold on a second. Let me let me swap out the cards real quick. Oh, you, oh, you know what? It's actually got the my 4G LTE SIM card. Um, I'm getting 4G. It should soon pick up 4G LTE here because I get good signals here. Um, looking very good. Let's go look at all the bloatware, AT&T Navigator. Um, all share play. I hate those things. Uh, AT&T. Actually, not too much bloatware except for YP Mobile um, and AT&T Navigator and Chat On, which all comes with the all of the um, Galaxy S3 series. Um, but I really like the blue version. Um, it's actually I like the metallic look of it, 
you don't like the white version, um, you can get this one. And uh, I'll definitely have um, rooting, ROMs, and all that. Uh, one thing we know now is that the AT&T Galaxy S3 is pretty much interchangeable with the ROMs on T-Mobile Galaxy S3. So this should be able to run a T-Mobile network and also vice versa. So these two phones should be able to be, um, you just have to probably put a T-Mobile modem in the AT&T. And the T-Mobile version actually works uh, out of the box with the T-Mobile um, modem for AT both AT&T and T-Mobile. So that's good news. Um, other than that, uh, oh, there you go. I got 4G LTE up there. I don't know if you can see it. Let me zoom in here. Um, so I've got all of them. I just got to go to the Sprint store and pick up the last uh, last collection, and I'll have all the collections, and I'm going to be working really hard. And uh, I think that's it. Um, and I'll have links to the T-Mobile unboxing, the Galaxy S3 unboxing, um, if you want to check those out, and uh, um, I'll have a full review for all four phones. I haven't actually reviewed them fully um, because I I wanted to get all four hands on, and then you know that way I have I could have like a you know cool uh, review. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching my video. Uh, if you have a Galaxy S3, AT&T, T-Mobile, um, i9300, or, or Sprint, or even Verizon, you can go sign up for my email list at Galaxy S. 3root.com we uh, update you with ROM of the week um, tips hacks and more and uh, I think my lighting is kind of I don't know why it's kind of weird today but anyway anyway I'll have more cool stuff and uh, go ahead and sign up and um, you can get some help from me uh, via email and if you're on YouTube please hit that like button here subscribe button up there and uh, use that share button to share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. And all, a lot of you have been asking me for T-Mobile unrooting method. I'm actually uploading it like right now over at my other channels. So check, 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 check it out over at uh, High on Android. Android. Anyway, um, don't buy an iPhone. We all know it sucks. And Apple is a horrible company for suing everybody for something stupid. We all know that. Anyway, see you all later. Screw Apple.